my friends, it is Crystal. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to take you along with me to Kirkland's and we are going to do a little bit of Christmas decor shopping. Now I've already done a little bit online and I shared those pieces in my last video, the Christmas decor haul. So if you wanna see some of the other items I've already shopped at Kirkland's, definitely go back and watch that video. But I'm excited to actually get into the store and see how they have everything decorated. And if I find anything, I will share it at the end of this video. I really wasn't quite sure how much Christmas decor would be out, but I was pleasantly surprised. They have it always broken out where they have more of the traditional red colors to one side and then the neutrals to the other. So I will just work my way around the store and share with you all of the beautiful Christmas decorations. I absolutely love anything with the red truck for Christmas and these two pieces really caught my eye. I love the snowflake wheels and this pillow is super nice quality. I always wondered what I would do with these large bells because I'm always drawn to them. I actually saw a really cute Christmas tree where someone had nestled a couple of them into the top of their tree by their tree topper. It looked so pretty. And I also really love these black deer perfect accent to your red decor. As I'm walking through the store, I noticed that they had a really good mix of pieces that come back year after year, as well as some of the newer items as well. So definitely worth checking out if you live near a Kirkland's. I always love this train. I think it would be so cute under a Christmas tree. But I would also notice that there were so many more gnomes this year than any other year. Have you noticed that at all? There's gnomes everywhere. A little spoiler alert, I did not pick up any Christmas pillows on this trip, which I know will surprise some of you. This black lantern, I'm actually going to talk about a little bit later, but it is huge and it is so beautiful. Kirkland's has a very good collection to choose from when it comes to these pre-lit Christmas gifts. They actually happen to be on sale when I was here. And I found red ones, I found black, frosted, unfrosted, many different options. These are just so pretty when they're lit up at night. If you are enjoying today's video, I would appreciate it if you hit that thumbs up button. It lets me know that you are loving these Christmas shop with me's and are excited to decorate. I know I cannot wait much longer. I've already shared a Hobby Lobby shop with me and haul, a big Christmas decor haul, and I've decorated our bedroom as well for Christmas. So if you have missed those videos, I will make sure to have those linked down below.
Of all the gnomes I've seen, these little ones on the sleds are the best in my opinion. They are so cute. Lots of new florals and picks to choose from. These work out great for accenting in your Christmas tree, or you can even put them in a vase. They're pretty all kinds of different ways, but I really love these with the bells attached to them. Haven't seen those in any of the other stores. I can't decide though if I like the red or the galvanized ones better. Now we're moving over to the more neutral decor portion of the store, but I'm curious, let me know in the comments below, are you decorating more with traditional reds and greens decor this year, or are you going more for the neutral look? I honestly, I love both. It's really hard for me to choose. I have a soft spot for my red decor, so I think I will always be a traditional decorator, but I definitely see the beauty in going more with the whites and the greens. They're both really pretty.
if I didn't already have a couple of snowflake pillows this year, I would have totally grabbed this one. They're so pretty in person. And oh my goodness, let's talk about this giant cloche. It might not look like it, but it is huge. So pretty. This would make a really pretty centerpiece. But as for the table wares, I think there's more to come for this section. There were a few plates and dishes out, but I think there's definitely more to come. The great pillars of wreaths get me every time. I mean, how do they get those down when they actually need them? It just seems like such a pain but lots of options to choose from whether you love the traditional or the flocked look as well as some pretty swags as well but i wanted to finish off this shop with me with sharing some of the candles i feel like kirkland's has stepped up their game on the three wicks some really good scents this year there's a gingerbread that sounds really good and they're only 9.99 I am back home now, wanted to share with you everything that I picked up. It's a small but mighty type of haul. Well, the items aren't even small, but there's not very many of them. I fell in love with this giant floor lantern. I've never seen one this big. And so I have that on my wish list for possibly my birthday, which is next week. So we'll see if I end up doing it. But if you remember, I showed this huge black lantern. I think it was three foot tall, I've never seen one, and I just thought it was so cool. So I have one item that I left with on my birthday wish list. But other than that, I do have a few items to share with you. Actually, only one thing from the Christmas shop. So the coupon was pretty terrible when I was there. It was only 25% off of one item, but they happen to have these, I think you could see the signs in the store, that they had their pre-lit Christmas gifts, decor, that is, they aren't gifts. Well, you, you'll see what I mean, but they were 20% off. So that was the one main thing that I wanted to get, and they had like four or five different options of these gifts. I really wanted to find some at Hobby Lobby, but they have had the same Buffalo check ones every year. And so I'm glad I held out because these are beautiful. Let me pull them out of the sack. I was telling the employee there, she was kind of stocking the shelves. I'm like, I cannot decide. I came here for these gifts. I do not know which ones to get because they had red, black, they had a plaid, and then they had these. And I ultimately went with these just because I felt like these would match any decor over the years. And if I really wanted to, I could still add a ribbon. So here are the, these are pre-lit Christmas gifts. They came in three sizes. This is the champagne one, although to me it kind of just looks silver. I mean, it could pull off maybe a little bit of the champagne, but it's mostly silver in my mind. But so I got the larger one, and then I also got the medium. I left the small one behind. I kind of regret that now as I'm sitting here, but I think two will be good, kind of just propped up next to each other. And they do light up. They come with little battery packs. So I thought these would be a fun addition. I've wanted some of these kind of like decorative gifts for a couple of years now. And so I was glad that they had them like fully stocked. So let's see, the larger one before the discount, let's see here, $29.99. And then the medium was $19.99, but they are so pretty. And of course I'm wearing black and I'm getting glitter everywhere, but I am going to use these in our living room. So those are the only Christmas specific items that I picked up, like I mentioned. I already shared a few items that I've ordered online. I had my eye on these picks, but they were $8.99 a piece for one stem. And without the discount, that adds up very quickly if you wanna add them into your tree. So I left them behind and I feel pretty good about that. It was getting a little bit too expensive. But I did use my coupon, the 25% off of one item on this piece right here. And I believe this is new to the stores. I had never seen it. 
but I've been looking for a black sort of decorative piece to layer on our mantle. I'm going to mix things up for Christmas time, do some layering with our stockings, and this is perfect. So this is what I went and used my coupon on, normally $59.99, a little bit pricey. So I only got one of them, but they are so pretty. They are, does it tell you, the, it does not tell you the dimensions, but I can link it because I do know this is on their website. I I went ahead and checked on that but just a fun accent piece that I want to layer and then eventually it'll probably make its way onto a wall somewhere this would even look really pretty with a wreath on it for Christmas time lots of fun ways you could use this around Christmas or throughout the season so I was happy to find that I was not expecting it the last item I have to share with you is actually one that I did a store pickup on I just had a feeling that the one day I actually make my trip to Kirkland's, the coupon was going to be awful, and it was, so I'm glad I did it. So I got 25% off of this footstool, or an ottoman, or extra seating, whatever you want to call it, but I have been looking for something to go in my office, in front of these chairs where you could just sit and kick your feet up, look at the Christmas tree, or just have a cup of coffee, or just relax, you know? And so I found this one, I don't know if it's new or not, but I was very excited because it goes really well with my decor in here. But this is the lid to it, so it has storage in it. The twins already put their Hot Wheels or some of them in there. They moved right on in, but this is the color of it. I will most definitely be scotch guarding this and taking good care of it. But yeah, I was happy to find that as well but that's all i have to share with you from kirkland's today now i did also go to home goods and tj maxx and i thought about including that in today's video but i actually think i'm going to push it into my next video which will be a vlog so in the next video we'll go into home goods and i'll share with you the few items that i picked up there's not many don't worry <laughs> but i did find the last thing on my wish list which was a red blanket so I will share that with you in my next vlog, so stay tuned for that. But now the fun part begins, the Christmas decorating. But thank you so much for watching. As always, if you enjoyed it, hit that thumbs up button, and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye.